Hi. Uh, today we are checking about the security of the document. So for that, uh, we need to update some property. Uh, we need to update some security uh, on the class. I'm just opening the class which we have created last time. It's a test class one. So there is a multiple types of uh, security like the default instance. If we have not changed any property uh, or the using any new property, then this property is uh, going to set the by default. But there is just some more properties are there. Security policies and the security security policies we will talking about later. Now we are talking about the security. These are the already created security. Means the already selected some names, some user names. You can also add uh, any new user name on there. Now uh, this one, like I'm going to search in you know, a P8 and click on a search. So it's showing some name which is started with a P8. Okay, eight users so I'm selecting and click on a and it on the right side. If you are checking on the below, these are some controls on there, means the permission types, the, the view all properties, links, read permission, write permissions, modify, delete, create, and modified all. So if you want to give the full control, then you can uh, select as a full control. But if you want to give in some like to modify property, then click on a modify property. And uh, if you want to some only the view permission, then you can give the view only. Uh, these are going to change, but you can also set the, if you have changed anything, then it's going to as a custom. But if you are going to give only the view permission, then unselect all this and uh, only select the view all property. And uh, if you also given the permission to read the permission who can access, then you can select this. Okay. Apart from this, uh, you can give as per uh, your preference. I'm selecting for now as a full control and click on OK. See the P8 users is there. That is already added, but uh, I have added one more time. So that's why. And uh, if you want to save, then you can save this. OK, I'm going to also save. If you want to change some permissions on there, like to uh, P8 user, now it's having the full control. But I'm going to change this. So just add it. And uh, if you want to change the permission, then you can change. See, when I'm selecting as a view property, then all these are unselected. So now uh, he's only the permissions of the view property and the read permissions. I'm going to click save. Yeah, it's save. Okay, now uh, I'm going to create a one more document on there inside the dev. Just refresh and add one more document. Click on a browse. You can take any document uh, like to this one. Test class. Role name is there that you can uh, give as a any for a testing purpose. And uh, yeah, select is class. We have selected the right class. Click on add. So now this document is also going to create. 
in this folder yeah the document is there and the uh, seat test class name and the document title and the user is there so we need to check the permissions of this what the permission we have that we have changed i have right click this and uh, now you can show these multiple options is there so i'm going to create i'm going to click on a security see uh, p8 users uh, is only having the reader permission means only uh, the view document and the view property these two permissions he is having but apart from this that's uh, uh, i have not changed and these users having the full permission yeah thank you